Live from Helenwood, it's The Tonight Show with Tom Brown, along with his guests, Roy Orbison, Conway Twitty, Dwight Yoakam, Marilyn Monroe, Loretta Lynn, Johnny Cash, Garth Brooks, and Joan Embry from the San Diego Zoo. And now, ladies and gentlemen, here's Tommy. Susan a clean edit right there just so that's for you Susan and Colonel yeah for you too Bill uh, how's everybody doing this evening good, good well excuse me I had the taco bar uh, mm. this is a very special show this is our tributes show this is an opportunity for you to see some of the legends of, of, of rock and rock and roll history and country music and uh, you know, since these guys get to do a tribute to their favorite artists, I, another one? I'm on my third one now, okay. Yeah. This is the one that makes me funny, so I'm very happy with this one. Got the filter and everything, I paid for that. Uh, I get to pay tribute to my favorite artist besides Elvis, and that would be Johnny Carson. And please explain to the young people who he was. I would say he was the guy before Jay Leno, but you would have to explain who Jay Leno was. So, you know, I measure my age by how many Tonight Show hosts I've lived through. And I'm currently on like my fourth. So I'm really not happy about that. Um, there's a lot of things going on in the world. Uh, there is a new survey out. I don't know if you saw this, you were probably doing all your Elvis festival stuff. You didn't get an opportunity to read the news. There's a new, uh, new survey out that, uh, well, they have reasons now, the top reasons that toddlers have tantrums. Parents answered questions about why a toddler would go crazy. And it was some interesting tantrum reasons, really. And maybe I could share a few with you right now. Really, the way they're freaking out. One of them, a mom said that she wouldn't allow her toddler to play in the toilet. And the <laughs> toddler just freaked out. Also, another toddler thought the dirt on the floor was a monster, so he didn't want to walk around. That was pretty sad. Didn't say a lot about mom's housekeeping. Also, one mom gave her toddler spaghetti, and that little child didn't like the color red, so refused to eat the spaghetti. So there's things you have to think about as a parent. And another one freaked out because his shirt wasn't pants. He wanted to wear his shirt as pants. I still have stuff left on that one. There you go. Also, it made me uh, wonder, Georgia's a right-to-work state. I couldn't get a union guy. So, <laughs> so, those toddler tantrums reminded me of some tantrums that, you know, are going on sometimes backstage. ETAs, ETAs have tantrums. They do. Don't get ahead of me. It's not that funny. Um, I could have just got you with just the concept. I don't actually have to write punchlines for whoever's. Um, sometimes, I, there was a tantrum earlier this week. Uh, one of the ETAs, I won't tell you who it was, Michael Culifer. He said, um, <laughs> said but I don't want to do three corn patches. So there was, that, there was that tantrum. Also, another one got, got very upset, very upset, Ben Thompson. The, uh, said, everybody stop, everybody stop, I've lost my wig. So... That was a bad tantrum. And then there was another ETA that got mad because his shirt wasn't pants. <laughs> See, that's a callback to the earlier joke about they got now. There you go, quickly, we're gonna get out of here. Uh, today, April 6th, oh my goodness, not a good day today to be a celebrity, April 6th, not a good day. This is true, Tammy Wynette died this day in 1998. 
Yeah, she did. Merle Haggard died this day on his birthday on this day in 2016. Not a good day to be a celebrity. Don Rickles died this day in 2017. Happy birthday, Code. <laughs> Happy birthday. You know, I don't want to say anything could happen to you because Lord knows you're young. But I might as well, you might as well just, you might want to just punch 9-1 into the phone just to be ready where you just got one, one number left. And, and by the way, Coat, I don't know if you can hear me. I don't know where you are. I don't know if you can hear me, but you share a birthday with Ant-Man. Paul Rudd has a birthday today. He turns, he turns 54. And he still looks younger than Coat. I don't know how he does that. Finally, finally, you're going to be happy. I didn't pay for the ending, Spark. FDA, FDA is warning people, the Food and Drug Administration, I don't know if you know who that is, because some of you probably know about one of those letters more than the other. Um, they are warning people not to do the um, TikTok gum challenge. It's very bad. I don't know if you know about it. It's true. It's true. Uh, it involves chewing super hot uh, trouble bubble gum. It's called trouble bubble gum. It's super hot, and it's got a Scoville heat unit rating of 16 million on the scale. That's how they measure heat, the Scoville. Bill Cherry's like a 75,000 on the Scoville chair. But, <laughs> but this 16 million, this gum, has the same heat rating as some of the hottest peppers in the world. And kids are chewing this as a challenge. And of course, it has to be on TikTok. They're, they're shooting a video of themselves doing it. And a lot of them have gone to the hospital. They burn their throats. They burn their mouths. They've, they've, they, they, their stomachs are swelling up. I mean, it's, it's a terrible thing. Hey, if anybody sees Rianne, see if she wants to do the TikTok gum challenge. It's all in fun. She's not here, she can't hear me. Hey, the tavern is open from nine to 11 for brunch every morning, 11 to two for lunch, four to eight for a limited menu, and 11 in the morning, because it is the Jeff Lewis Festival. It's open from 11 to 9 p.m. for alcohol. So you've had plenty of opportunity to, she, to see what tonight could be the funniest show you ever see. <laughs> Just a rem reminder for tomorrow, 11 a.m., the bar opens. The more you drink, the funnier the show is. Now that we have a bar here in the showroom, we're going to just call this one the showroom bar. I just named it right there. Just did. It's open back there. They've got all kinds of specialty drinks. They've got the blue suede shoes. They've got the pink Cadillac. And they've got the old-fashioned Elvis. And in case you've lost your sense of smell, they have the popcorn back in the back. <laughs> They also have candy and chips, but they're all out of chips and candy's off tonight, so. That was, that was for you, yeah. All right, we've got some legends coming in here tonight, as you heard from my announcer, and plus, if we have time, Joan Embry from the San Diego Zoo. The legends of music are here tonight. Conway Twitty, we've got Dwight Yoakam, we've got Marilyn Monroe, and trust me, some people travel further to be here, and Marilyn was one of them. Uh, we've also got Loretti Lynn, we've got J.R. Cash, we have a lot of cash tonight for you, and we've got Garth. But not the one you think, from Wayne and Garth, this is from Wayne's World, it's Garth, it's, yeah. Really, I was kind of disappointed too, frankly, because all he, he just, he's a, you know, sidekick. But first up, We've got the Caruso of rock. We've got the Big O. What did he say? He's been called the Big O, but he's the man in black and white. Yes, the man who will sing to you beautiful songs and who Elvis said had the most beautiful voice in rock and roll. To kick off tributes tonight, say hello to Mr. Roy Orbison. <laughs> Street, pretty woman, the kind of like to me, pretty woman. I don't believe you, you're not the truth. No one can look as good as you. Mercy. 
Pretty woman, won't you pardon me? Pretty woman, I couldn't help but see. Pretty woman, you look lovely as can be. Are you lonely just like me? I'll go on home this late There'll be tomorrow night Boy, what do I see?
Roy Orbison. Oh my goodness, that's right. We're gonna keep it going now. We, uh, how many of you out there love music? Well, that gentleman right there recorded for Sun Records. We got another gentleman that recorded for Sun Records too and went on to have a fabulous career in country music. Born in Mississippi, but grew up in Arkansas, a member of the Country Music Hall of Fame and the Rockabilly Hall of Fame. Born under the name of Harold Jenkins, but something about showbiz just wouldn't do, you know? He's the high priest of country music. He is the best friend a song ever had. Please say hello to Charlie Watson's friend, Conway Twitty. Nice to see it's been a long time you're just as lovely as you used to be how's it you love are you happy hope you're doing fine just to know it means so much to me What's that, darling? How am I doing? Guess I'm doing all right Except I can't sleep And I cry all night till dawn And what I'm trying to say Is I love you And I miss you And I'm so sorry that I did you wrong? Look up, darling. Let me kiss you. Just for old time's sake, let me hold you in my arms one more time. Thank you, darling. May God bless you and may each step. You take, bring you closer to the things you seek to find. Well, goodbye, darling. I gotta go. I gotta try to find a way to lose his memories of a love so warm and true. And if you should ever find it in your heart to forgive me come back darling I'll be waiting for you you guys are fantastic we don't have much time to mess around tonight. We got a lot. We got a lot of stars here, so I got to get right to the good stuff. That's okay. Kick it off. She tried to hide it by the faded denim clothes she wore. But I knew she'd never been inside a bar before And I felt like a peasant who just had met her queen And she knew I saw right through her tight jeans Well, I asked her, what's a woman like you doing here? I see you used to champagne, but I'll buy you a beer she said, you got me figured out, but I'm not what I'd say. And for a dance, I'll tell you about these tight jeans. She said, I'm wearing money, and I'm used to wearing pearls. But I've always dreamed of being just a good old boy's girl. So tonight, I left those crystal candlelights to live a dream. And partner, there's a tiger in these tight jeans. Here we go. Here we, 
We danced every dance and Lord the beer that we went through. I'm satisfied I did my best to make her dreams come true. As she played out a fantasy before my eyes had seen a cowgirl came alive inside those tight fitting jeans. In my mind, she's still a lady, that's all I'm gonna say. I knew that I'd been broken by the time we parted ways. And I know I held a woman in most eyes I've ever seen. That night I knew a lady wearing tight fitting jeans. Well, now she's back in her world, and I'm still stuck in mine. But I know she'll always remember the time a cowboy once had a millionaire's dream. Lord, I love that lady wearing tight fitting jeans. Everybody say, Yeehaw! All right, thank you so much. You guys are fantastic. Well, I always say this, and I only have a few songs left. My goal is to be the best Conway tribute artist in the world. So, and, and I only get to do that by having the opportunities to get up in front of folks like you. So I'm grateful to be here tonight, and I hope you enjoyed my three songs. And we're going to close it out with probably the biggest song Conway had, Sales Wise. It goes like this. People see us everywhere. They think you really care. But myself, I can't just see. I know it's only make believe. My one and only prayer is that someday you'll care. My hopes, my dreams come true. My one and only you. No one will ever know how much I love you so. My only prayer will be someday you'll care for me, but it's only me. Believe my hopes, my dreams come true. My I give for you my heart a wedding ring my all my everything my heart I can't control you rule my very soul My hopes, my dreams come true. My one and only you. No one will ever know how much I love you so. Thank you so much. Thank you. Conway Twitty. Conway Twitty. Man, I love it. You're looking great. Doesn't Conway look good? Oh, my goodness. I've got to get me a necklace with my initials on it. Conway said he'd sell me his, but i got to change my name. All right, next up, it's like a fire tornado is just wiping its way through the building. All kinds of stuff is happening. We're about to go west coast style we've got a singer songwriter actor film director coming up born in kentucky he's a student of honky-tonk music he's a student of classic country and also the bakersfield sound he sold over 25 million albums had 13 top 10 hits here we go to bakersfield everybody hang on
Dwight Yoko! Hey! Listen to Dawson. Listen to Dawson. Listen to Dawson. Kiss me once or twice. Tell me that it's nice and then you Around. Oh, the sister, don't you do what you big sister does? Hup, 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 hup. I dated your big sister. I took her to the show. We went for some candy and long candy and we stuck right out the door. The sister, don't you? The sister, don't you? This is the dog, she kissed me once or twice Tell me that it's nice to let me run Oh, sister, don't you do what your big sister does Hup, hup, And piss your turn and no But maybe you've been growing honey It's been showing from your head now to your toes Listen to Dawson Listen to Dawson Listen to Dawson Don't you kiss me once or twice And tell me that it's nice and then you run How Listen to Don't you do watch a big sister Huh, huh, huh well, now every time I see a sister, she's with somebody near. She may say she's evil, but alone, but we will get some try. This is the dog. This is the dog. This is the dog. Kiss me once or twice and tell me that it's nice and then you run. Oh, this is the dog. You do what your big sister does. This is the dog. You do what your big sister does. One more time, boys. Oh. The sister, don't you do what your big sister does? Thank you all so much. Thank you. Take it on. Maybe someday I'll be strong. Maybe it won't be long. You'll be the one who's got to run It won't be long and maybe I'll be real strong And maybe I'll do things right Maybe I'll start to learn you learn to cry like me Maybe let's just wait and see Maybe I'll do things right
my good friend Buck Owens on me this next one. so much y'all been beautiful. So sweet. 
But this man, the guitarist, can't last Hillbilly music The lonely, lonely streets that I call home This man, the guitarist, can't last Hillbilly music The only thing that keeps me hanging on Glamour in this tinsel land of hopes and shattered dreams. Painful scars are all that's left to me. I oh, to thank you, girl, for teaching me brand new ways to be cruel. If you don't mind now, I guess I'll just leave. This my guitar's Cadillacs, hillbilly music, the lonely, lonely streets that I call home. Guitars, Cadillacs, hillbilly music The only thing that keeps me hanging on What is it? Course now. Well, this man, the guitar is Cadillacs, hillbilly music, the only thing that keeps me hanging on. Well, this man, the guitar is Cadillacs, hillbilly music, the only thing that keeps me hanging on. Well, it's the only thing that keeps me hanging on. Thank y'all so much, thank you. That's right, thank you, Sparky, for that. I didn't know you uh, did a little Flocko there. That's that's very nice. On the uh, that's the name of the gentleman who played the accordion, Flocko. That was you know, I wasn't making up a curse word in Spanish. <laughs> People are like what? he called him a Flocko. <laughs> My goodness, I was talking about fire tornadoes. I think that was a fire tornado. Well, you know the word acorn gets thrown around a lot. Oh, I'm sorry, icon, not acorn. Sorry. <laughs> I have really got to work on my penmanship, I, I tell you, this is just not, icon, icon, gets thrown around a lot and, and there are very few icons in the world that are known by one name, but the one we have for you next has been known for years by one name, she's also known as the blonde bombshell, one of the legends of the silver screen, loved by fans and presidents all over the world. <laughs> You know, before Madonna, before Raquel Welsh, before Anne Margaret, before Liz Taylor, before Sophia Loren, before most people that you would think about as a bombshell, there's the original bombshell. That's right. Excuse me. That's tacos. <laughs> In the words of my friend Tony Curtis, who filmed a movie with her, he said, she was full of talent, so much talent, she just couldn't remember her lines. <laughs> well, you know what? If you're talented like this, and trust me, guys, if you're talented like this, you don't have to remember your lines. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, so glad this evening to have the icon, Marilyn. <laughs> Marilyn Monroe. <laughs> Tiger, tiger, I wanna kiss you. Wow, 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 wow. Take 
Georgia, we are just staying positive and testing negative. <laughs> For most things, anyway. Well, I'm so happy to be here in Georgia. You know, I heard the devil was down here. <laughs> or is he in the White House? I don't know. That's okay, he doesn't know either. <laughs> well, I'm gonna sing another song for you, is that all right? Yeah. Good, because I was going to anyway. Because Tom Brown said that I had to earn my money some way. And I chose singing. <laughs> because that was the only legal option he gave me. He did want to reenact a scene from Some Like It Hot. We were going to role play. Except he was going to be Marilyn and I was going to be Tony Curtis. That's called gender bending. <laughs> I've gender bended a few times. And that's all I'm going to say about that. When I sing this song, is it all right if I come down there so we can get better acquainted? I can't see very good up here. Is that okay? Yeah. Oh, you sound like mostly women. <laughs> well, that's okay. I'll try anything once. Hit it, fellas. I want to be just you, nobody else but you. I want to be loved by you alone. Boop, boop, be too. I want to be kissed by you, just you, nobody else but you. I want to be kissed by you alone. To anything I 
your name? Chris. Chris. Oh, that's my very favorite name. I just love how it rolls off the tongue. Chris. Tell me, Chris, what do you do for a living? I'm a publisher. A publisher? What do you publish? Comic books. Comic books. Oh, I love to read. Tell me, are you involved? Yes. Nice knowing you, Chris. I'm not doing that again. Let's see here. Oh, hi there, handsome. What's your name? I don't remember. You don't remember? Well, I'm just going to call you Daddy. Is that all right? Yeah, that's good. Okay, Daddy. Well, I'm going to sing the rest of my song to you. Are you ready? I thought you might say that. Well, Daddy, how's the old ticker? Does it work good? Real good. Working real good, okay. Well, I need you to just brace yourself and get ready for what's coming, all right? You ready? Better buckle up, gonna be a bumpy ride. I couldn't aspire to anything higher than the view of a desire. It's not just his heart that's working. I wanna be loved by you, just you, and nobody else but you. I wanna be loved by you, but diddly 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 da, boop boop be do. Oh, oh, thank you, Elisa. Thank you so much. So, tell me, Daddy, are you married? Yes. Yes. To her? Yes. How long? Almost 52 years. 52 years? Oh. And it all went down the drain in two minutes. What's your name, darling? Barbara. Thank you ever so for letting me ride Daddy here. But you're stuck with him. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I do have a confession to make. You see, I've just been... I've been very distracted since I've been out here. And I must admit, there is a gentleman to blame. But it's not his fault, he doesn't know. But I will let you in on a teeny weeny secret. It is his birthday today. And, you know, I just... Hi, Big Daddy Cody. <laughs> you know, because it's your birthday, one needs someone to sing happy birthday to them. Would you mind if I would be that one to sing happy birthday to you? Not at all. <sighs> the only problem is, Cody Poo, I'm shy. So, we have to go somewhere where we can be alone. Yeah, give that. Give that to Cousin It. Come on. <laughs> Come on. Come on, let's hurry. Hurry, Cody. Come right through here. Come on. Come on. Here we go, Cody. Now, look at him. Isn't he cute? You know, I've been so looking forward to this. Now, Cody, we're going to get a seat for you. Looks to me like you already got a pretty good one. But we're going to get you another. Now, wait a minute. Wait a minute. I have jokes for this stool. Isn't it just like Amanda want to hurry up and get it over with before I'm done? than me. You should have more stamina. Now, Cody, it's, that's not his fault either. It's the dress. Now, Cody, funny thing about this stool is we went through an awful lot of stool samples. The 
before we decided on this particular stool, and this stool sample has your name written all over it. Cody Poo. <laughs> you folks better laugh now. That's as good as it gets. My jokes are sh crap. Now, you may have a seat, Cody Poo. Oh, he does what he's told. Like a good little puppy. Are you comfortable? Is the stool too hard? We could always get a stool softener. <laughs> Are you comfortable? My feet are dangling, so yes. It's oh, okay. Did you say they're tingling? Dangling. Dangling. Dingling? Cody, we're gonna make you a little more comfortable before I sing to you anyhow. Don't you think you need to be made a teeny weeny bit more comfortable? Yes, I think so. Well, normally I would start by removing your hat, but I probably shouldn't touch your hair. Up there. So. Or we'll take it off. Oh, Cody. You've got runner's legs. I think we should show those off too, don't you? Hold this, please. <laughs> Jeez, Cody, you just get hairier as we go down. I'm an Indian, so you know what I mean? It runs in my... I think you mean Native American. No, I'm, I'm the ones that go, thank you, come again. Oh. I love Mexico. Still not getting it, are we? See, see, yes, see. See, yeah, I see pretty good. Now, Cody, are you ready? As I'll ever be. <laughs> what about you? Are you ready? Yeah! What a coincidence because I'm ready too. Have you seen my show before? She's saying my lines. Now, get ready. Brace yourself, Big Daddy. Happy birthday. time he's been there. <laughs> Dear... <laughs> Why do y'all think I work so much? Happy birthday to who? Me. To you. Oh. I 
just love you so much. I love you. How old are you? I don't remember. <laughs> that happens sometimes. Well, let's hear it one time. Oh, you got a little something. You got a little something. Let me see. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm very sorry. Do that again. Let's hear it for Cody. He did a wonderful job. Now I'm going to be on every festival coming up. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I've got to go. I've got to catch a flight to Washington, D.C. The president's expecting me. I didn't say I voted for him. I said he's expecting me. Oh, you must be Republicans. That's why you laughed at my dirty jokes. Well, ladies and gentlemen, before I go, always remember the French are proud to die for love. They delight in fighting duels, but I prefer a man like Cody who lives in geese. Thank you. Thank you, Everson. Bye bye now. Well, I have one thing to say. I am so glad it's not my birthday. And, and, and to think the fact that Joe DiMaggio and Arthur Miller are back there watching right now, uh, just absolute uh, hysterics. Um, when you leave this festival and you're telling stories, be gentle on that one. <laughs> okay? Just be gentle. Uh, Cody always did like older women, though, so, you know. Next up, another woman, but we're going to go in the direction of a music icon, a legend of country music, a singer, songwriter, 24 number one singles, a member of the Country Music Hall of Fame. Oh my goodness, she has told her story in books and movies. She is the coal miner's daughter. And do loved her and we love her too, do. Ladies and gentlemen, say hello to the legend of country music, Miss Loretta Lynn. You've come to tell me something You say I ought to know That he don't love me anymore And I'll have to let him go You say you're gonna take him Oh, but I don't think you can Cause you ain't woman enough To take my man
do better than that. How are we doing, Helen, Georgia? This here is a song I wrote about my daddy. I sure do love my daddy. It goes something like this. Well, I was born to call my new daughter in a cabin on a hill in Butcher Hollow. We were poor, but we had love, and that's the one thing my daddy made sure of. He shoveled coal to make a poor man's dollar. My daddy worked all night in the Van Leer coal mine. All day long in the fields of hoeing corn. Mommy rocked the babies at night and read the Bible by the coral light. And everything would start all over come break up. Mommy scrubbed our clothes on a washboard every day. Well, I've seen her fingers bleed to complain there was no need. She'd smile in Mommy's understanding way. In the summertime, we didn't have shoes to wear. But in the wintertime, We'd all get a brand new pair From a meadow to catalog The money raised from seven a hall My daddy always managed to get the money somewhere Sing along, Helen Georgia! And it's so good to be in Helen, Georgia again. Not much left but the floor. Nothing lives here anymore except the memory of a coal miner's daughter. God bless you all. everyone's hand as they come off stage because I wish someone would hold my hand when I come off stage. It's dark back there and I'm old and I don't roll as well as I used to. Next up in our tribute show, the music continues. Another country music icon started out at Sun Records there at 706 Union Avenue and moved on into the world of country. It sold 90 million records worldwide. I think my dad bought every single one of them so I grew up with his music in the house. Member of the Country Music Hall of Fame, the Gospel Music Hall of Fame, also has a movie about his life called Walk the Line. Please say hello to the man in black, John R. Cash. Johnny Cash! <laughs> We do got a sound guy back there, all right. I don't know what was going on. I keep a close watch on this heart of mine. I keep my eyes wide open all the time. I keep the ends out for the tide that buys. What is it, Helen? Because you're mine. What? 
Put your hands up, lady. Um, you got a way to keep me on your side. You give me calls for love that I can't hide. For you, I know I'd even try to turn the tide. Because you're mine. What? I walk the line. Yeah. Um, I sing the right notes. Mm -hmm. You got a way to keep me on your side. You give me calls for love that I can't hide. For you, I know I'd even try to turn the tide. Sing it because you're mine. You pull my twine. very very easy to be true you find yourself alone when each day is through yes I'll admit that I'm a fool for you because you're mine I walk the line one more time boys hey. um, can you hum um, Keep a close watch on this heart of mine I keep my eyes wide open all the time well, I keep the ends out for the tie that binds Because you're mine I walk the line Because you're mine I walk the line You like it so far? Well, I'm sure you already knew this, but hello, we're Johnny Cash. I hear the train a coming. It's rolling around a bit, and I ain't seen the sunshine since I don't know when. I'm stuck in post of prison, and time keeps dragging on. But that train keeps a rolling on down to sad and tall. When I was just a baby, my mama told me, son, always be a good boy, don't ever play with guns. I shot a man in Reno. Just to watch out him die. When I hear that whistle blowing, I hang my head and cry. Play it again. How about this imposter over here? I mean. I bet there's rich folks eating in a fancy dining car They're probably drinking coffee and smoking big cigars I know I had it coming, I know I can't be free But those people keep a moving, and that's what tortures me Play it, Luke! Is this too much cash for you? Well, if they freed me from this prison, if that railroad train was mine, I bet I'd move it on a little farther down the line. Far from Folsom Prison, that's where I want to stay. Yeah! And I let that lonesome whistle blow my blues away. Do it! It's kind of like looking in a mirror 
With different outfits. With different eyes. And a different face. And a different height. It's kind of like we're inverted. We're both got guitars going the opposite way. We do, huh? But we got one thing in common. What's that? Let's go to Jackson and find out. All right, let's go. Here we go, going to Jackson. Are you gonna be June? Yeah, I'll be June. Okay. Oh no, you will not. I'll oh. Be We got married in a fever, hotter than a pepper sprout. We've been talking about Jackson ever since the fire went out. I'm going to Jackson. Oh, you won't without me? I'm going to mess around. Better. I am. I'm going to Jackson. Look out, Jackson Town. Yeah! Well, go on. People gonna stoop and bow. No, they will not. All them ladies gonna make me. You better not. Tease them what they don't know how. I'm going to Jackson. He turned a loose of his coat. You oh, don't have to coat. He's going to Jackson. Goodbye, that's all she wrote. Tell him, John. Well, they laugh at you in Jackson. Get over here and I'll be dancing all Between your legs. That ain't a tail, yeah, honey. Go to Jackson. That's my pant. You big talking lamb. You big talking lamb. And I'll be waiting in Jackson for you two. You leaving me to love. Jay Pan fan. Well, we got married in a fever. Hotter than a pepper sprout. We've been talking about Jackson. Ever since the fire went out, I'm going, going to Jackson. Jackson. With, not without me, you won't. Isn't that a fact? It's a fact, you're going with me. Yeah, we're, we're going, going to Jackson. You're going to need a station wagon. I ain't ever coming back. back. Bring it down. Are you telling me to be quiet? You tell it. I know you're not. I'm telling the band to be quiet. I thought so. That was How are you going to hear a train coming if you're talking over it? Woo -hoo! Can we do it again? Woo -woo! We got married in a fever, hotter than a pepper sprout. Woo -woo! We've been talking about Jackson ever since the fire went out. I'm going to Jackson. We're going to Jackson. And that's a fact. You never know nowadays, do you? It's Boys a fact. Boys are like, they're going to Jackson. Jackson. Y'all ain't never going to be the same. They never come in back. Let's walk her off stage. All right. No, 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 you're not taking me anywhere. No, 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 no. We showed her, didn't we? All right, this song, we're going to make y'all help us sing, right? Let's do it. All right, kick it off there, Sparky. Let's start at the chorus if we could to warm up, all right? I fell into a... I went down, 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 and the... Brandon. The ring of fire, the ring of fire. Sing it, John. Love is a burning thing. And it makes a fiery ring Bow my wild desire I fell into a ring of fire Sing it, John! Yeah. I fell into a ring Went down, down, down And the 
damned it. What's it do? The ring of fire, the ring of fire. You make them sing. Play it on. What about Michael Culliver here as Johnny Cash? What about it? Cliff Wright as Johnny Cash, ladies and gentlemen. And the Fever Band. Let's go to that chorus now. But most importantly, Elvis. Yeah. I fell into a burning ring of fire. I went down, 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 and the flames went higher. And it burns, burns, burns. The ring of fire, the ring of fire. Sing it, Good take. Of love is sweet when hearts like ours meet. You tell them, John. I felt for you like a child, child. Oh, oh but the fire went wild. wild. Yeah. I fell into a burning ring of fire. Went down, 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 and the flames went. Birds, birds, birds. I think they can do it better. I hope so. If not, sounds like the event's already over. Yeah, let's do it. I fell into a. I went down, 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 and the. And it burns, burns, burns. The ring of fire, the ring of fire. And it burns, burns, burns. The ring of fire. The ring of fire. We are Johnny, Johnny Cash. Cash. Thank you guys so much. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, that's right. Okay, I came up with two names for that. No credit, cash only. Or or cash and carry. I'm just, I think the first one. I think the first one. I do know that June is my favorite month now. I do know that. How cool was that? I was just afraid they were going to kick the footlights out in Johnny Cash style. But Colifer broke a string, and that's very Johnny Cash. I'm telling you, Cliff and my, oh my goodness, how incredible. Now, next up, after the earthquake and sense around that we're experiencing right now, uh, we have a Grammy winner. That's right, we have a Grammy winner, the best-selling artist of the 20th century, beating out that guy. We should have gone back to the record store and updated our eight tracks, folks. We let this guy skirt in. He sold 170 million albums, and he doesn't even own a record store. Two, three, four. Member of the Country Music Hall of Fame, the Songwriter Hall of Fame, a proud son of Yukon, Oklahoma, one of Oklahoma's own, besides Jeff Lewis. Ladies and gentlemen, say hello to Garth Brooks. Yeah! I spent last night in the yard for the girl from Louisiana. The one out on the highway, my thoughts are still with her. Strange combination of a woman and a child. Such a strange situation, stepping every hundred miles to come back. roll through my mind Except I've seen her too Erased by sweeter red wine So I see a drug stop sign Head so I change the things I need a cup of coffee And a cup of dollar change To call Baton Rouge Here we go! Yeah! I'm ready for you put me on through I got a smile at another Baton Rouge Hurry up! Put her on the line Gotta talk to my girl Just one more time I got some my love and the bad root. Cherry up, put her on the line. 
Thank you so much. Thank you so much. This next song that we're going to do for you was a number one hit song back in 1991. One of my favorite songs. Who's, who out here is in love? Boys, y'all gonna get in trouble now. If you're here with your loved one, reach over and grab their hand. This is one of the most beautiful love songs that I've ever heard. It's called If Tomorrow Never Comes. <laughs> Sometimes late at night, I lie awake and watch her sleep. She's lost a peaceful dream, so I turn out the lights lay there in the dark. And the thought crosses my mind. Never wake up in the morning. Would she ever doubt the way I feel about her in my heart? Help me sing. If tomorrow never comes, yeah. Will she know? Will she know how much I love? song for you and this is an old Billy Joel song that was kind of number one hit song back in 1993 it's called Shameless we hope you like it Yeah. 
that's what's left of me. I don't have very far to fall. You know now I'm not a man who's ever been insecure about the world I've been living in. I don't break easy. I have my pride, but if you need to be satisfied, then I'm shameless. Honey, I don't have a prayer. Every time I see you standing there, I go down the hall. Swore I'd never compromise Oh, but you can miss me otherwise I'll do anything you please You see, in all my life I've never found What I couldn't resist What I couldn't turn down I could walk away from anyone I ever knew But I can't walk away from you I have never let anything Have this much control Spotlight one out. We'll be back. 